Hello everyone and welcome to Leany Boog. <laughs> I know absolutely nothing about this game. I just read the name of the game and that's all I need to know. Um, I guess it's a horror game. It looks like there's some sort of like fox character that's trying to kill you or something like that. It's a horror game. That's literally all I know. I just I just wanted to play it just because of the name of the game. <laughs> so uh, with all that being said, we're gonna start. We're gonna play. Um, also, I should mention, uh, I do have headphones, thank goodness. Um, in the menu there was a flashing image, but I'm gonna edit this so I don't, you know, cause any issues for anyone who may have issues with, uh, flashing images. Uh, if you decide to play this game or if you want to try the game for yourself, I'll leave a link in the description, but when you get into the menu there is a flashing image. Just to be safe, I want to make sure people know that, but for the sake of the video, I'm gonna edit that out, so. Just so we're all on the same page. Uh, how to play. The main task is to survive as long as possible. You need to listen carefully to where the monster runs and try to close the window in a timely manner so it cannot climb into the house. To close the window, you need to hold down the E button. This demo is impossible to pass. Well, then what's the point? <laughs> I guess you can just try to see how long you can live. Okay. Click this button if you are ready to start the game. I am ready to start the game. Starto the game -o. Thank you. Okay, we're in it. Um, so I just need to keep an eye on the windows. How many windows are there? Hello? I'm gonna have to turn up the sound. Cause I don't, oh, hey. I don't really hear anything. Uh, there we go. Ah! Oh God. Well, that's not off to the strongest start. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I tried. I guess, okay. Okay, I need to hold E, right? Hold down the E button, okay. Maybe, maybe, I guess my hand probably came off of the E button. Okay, I understand, I'm sorry. Being a little bit goofy, being a little bit doofy. Oh, what is all that? I don't know what all that is. I don't know if I have time to figure out what all that is. Where's the duder? Where's the duder? Where's the duder? Where's the duder? Where's the leany boog? Oh god, there's an upstairs too? Oh boy, I am dead. I am dead to rights. I'm gonna be so freaking dead. Oh my freaking gosh, I am so freaking dead. Um, okay. I might- Ah! My god, what the heck are you on? <laughs> I know sound is my weapon. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna turn up the sound and I'm gonna like, uh, mess with some of the settings because I'm getting a lot of screen tearing and not gonna lie. Um, also the mouse sensitivity is very, very sensitive. So let me goof around for a bit and I'll be right back. Okay, so apparently there's no way to turn down the mouse sensitivity, but I cranked up the volume. So hopefully I should be able to hear things better now, I hope. Okay. Like it's really quiet. I don't hear anything. What is this? I still don't know what all this is. Is it important? Do I need to know about it? I guess not. Okay. Not yet, at least. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully it's not important. Okay. Oh, there you are. Hi. Uh, does it matter if I close the window now or am I just dead? I think I'm just dead. I'm totally dead. Hi. Okay. Well, um, I'm starting to think maybe this dude is a little too good at what he's doing. Maybe, maybe they're a little too good at the game. I, however, am not. Okay. Hopefully it's just the one that I need to worry about. And it's not a, you know, Five Nights at Freddy's situation where, you know, there's going to be multiple that I need to worry about. If there's a bunny, I'm going to lose my mind. I have like no rhyme or reason to this either. Um, I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm trying to listen. Uh, for anything. But I don't hear anything. I'm afraid to turn up my volume anymore because it's already pretty loud. Nah, I'm probably dead. <laughs> ah! Right on cue. Right on cue. My goodness. Okay. <laughs> Your sense of timing is terribly impeccable. Okay. I wonder how long people have made it. I wonder if there's like a reverse speed run of this where people just try to stay alive as long as possible. I mean, that's really what a reverse speed run is, right? You try to play the game for as long as possible. I guess it would be never ending then at that point. Are we good? Okay, we're good. Okay. I'm starting to pick up on the sounds, but at the same time, they are very subtle and very quiet. Okay. So sometimes they go by unnoticed, especially considering how much I'm yapping. 
Okay. I'm gonna have to look up later and see how long people have been playing this for. Hello? Little wolfie? Little foxy buddy? Hi. You did that very quickly. Are you getting faster? I think you're getting faster. I made it past a minute though, so it's fine. You can murder me. Come on. Hurry up and kill me. Come on. Yep. Yep. Thank you. Thank you, Leany Boog, for ending my life. I made it a minute and 15 seconds. Okay. I know sound is my weapon. I don't have any weapons. I guess sound is your best defense then? Because I don't have anything to defend myself with either. <laughs> I just have to like listen. But like, you know. It's a blessing and a curse that there's not a lot of sound effects in the game. Because like you can clearly hear where they are. Oh, wait, no. <laughs> wait, I can't go that way. There's nothing going on over there. I can't get around. Are you over here now? I guess you just have to pace around the house and like listen for them. Oh, you trickster. No, no, God dang it. I heard you run off that way. You butthead. Well, okay. You're gonna sneak up behind me and go boogity boo, aren't you? I'm gonna hate that. I'm so gonna hate that. You're so downstairs, aren't you? Yeah. Okay. Well, at least I know where to find you. Hi. Okay, let me try to like concentrate on this and do less of the talkie talkie and more of the survivey. And uh, you know, we'll see how long I can last. Eh, you're in the house, fuck. Ah! Okay, that one really got me. <laughs> Jeez Louise, I was trying to turn down the sound before they got to me because I knew the sound was going to scare the shit out of me because I have the volume up so loud. Oh my god. <laughs> ha. Okay. Ha. Huh. You know what? I think that's going to do it. This is going to be a very short video. I'm sorry. I just, I didn't realize there wasn't much to this game, but that is going to do it for Leany Boog. Oh, Leany, I'm back. Did you miss me? I decided to come back and try again. Just to see if I can make it any further this time. Okay. So at least this time around, I at least have a little bit of an idea of what to do. Leany, no. Leany, no. Leany, no. Leany, no. Lean your way out of here. Git. Are you gone? I didn't hear anything. <laughs> Are you gone? I hope you're gone. Okay, you better be gone. I can't hear anything. I turned up the volume and everything. Aha, ha ha ha, ha ha, you're not gonna get me that easy, hi. Oh, my, how bright your eyes are. My, what big teeth you have, and my, how bright your eyes are. Okay. I might have to turn up the volume even more, is there- Oh, I heard that. I heard that. Leany? Are you heading upstairs, Leany? Little boogie? My little Leany boogie? Should I not call you that? I probably shouldn't call you that. I feel like that's just going to annoy you and you're going to try to kill me even faster. Leany, where'd you go? Come on. You got to tell me where you are, Leany. The party, it's not a party without you. Uh, and I want a party. Hey. Nick Wild. That's who he reminds me of. I was trying to think for the longest time. I was like, he reminds me of some other Fox character. And I don't want to say Foxy from Five Nights at Freddy's because that seems a little too obvious. But he's like a feral version of Nick Wilde. That's what it is. He's Nick Wilde if Nick Wilde went feral. I get it. <laughs> okay. So what exactly is the difference between like a leany boog and just a giant monster fox? I don't know. I have no idea. I also probably shouldn't ask him. Ah, uh, what the fox says, because he'll probably tell me. He's about to tell me. Hi. Hi, Leany. Can you can you answer one question for me? It's a little outdated. But can you tell me what exactly the fox says? No, I shouldn't have asked that. You're not going to answer now? Oh, nope. Here we go. Okay. That's not exactly how I remember it going, but good, good try. Okay. Not a good try on my part. I just want to see if I can make it up to like two minutes. You know, I just, I just want to see. I just want to see if I can push myself a little bit further. Go even further beyond in all that jazz. I hear that. I feel like there's a pattern, and I just haven't been paying attention. Do you have a pattern, Leany? Can I call you Leany? Oh, you don't have a pattern. You've never done this before. 
I really wish you would just come out and kill me. You're already in. I can't do anything about this. What happens? I can't even close that. Hi. Big chomp. Okay, great. So they've done some updates to the game. So I wonder if they changed his algorithm. Stay, 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 stay. Good. Good boogs. Good boogs. Who's the best boogs? You're the best boogs, leany boog. You're the best leaniest boog to ever boog. Okay. If you want to boogie on out of here, I wouldn't complain. <laughs> if you don't mind just leaving me alive. Ha, ah, I would not complain. Hi, buddy. You look so curious when you lean your head like that. It's kind of cute. Okay. It would be so much cuter. What the fuck? I held E. I'm stuck. What happened? Thank you for getting me unstuck. I was holding E. The freak. Okay. Maybe, I don't know. I guess I wasn't holding E hard enough. <laughs> no. Um, but yeah, if you, if you could just boogie on out for like, you know, a couple minutes just so I can beat my record. I would be very happy. That would make me Trey happy. Oh shit, I'm dead. He's downstairs. No, I was so close. Lainey, take your time coming in, please. Oh, god dang it. I was so close to two minutes. Dang it. Hi, buddy. It's good to see you too. If you don't mind, I'm not really in the mood for a smooch right now. Okay. I was so close. I was five seconds off. God dang it. Actually, like, shut up for, like, you know, <laughs> two minutes and went into try-hard mode. And it turns out, like, standing here is the best spot. Because you can hear when the, the, I don't know what they are, the shutters open from right here. Aha, uh -huh, there you are. Okay. But if you stand in the middle, did it go off? I think, yep, there it goes. If you stand in the middle over here, you can hear which side he's coming from. And it really just conserves energy and all that. You just have to be very quiet so you can actually hear the buzzer go off for the shutters. It just makes life a lot easier. Right, Leany? Oh, Leany. Leany, you're leaning into somewhere you shouldn't. You definitely come in way faster than you used to. Like, that has to be a thing. Has there always been music? I never realized the music before. Hi, Leany. I also want to know... Uh... I feel like I've just done the best I'm going to do. I've already reached my peak. <laughs> a minute 55 is going to be my peak. But I really want to know what this room back here is for, because I didn't really think about it the first time I was playing the game, but it has to serve some sort of purpose, right? Like, maybe this is like a frequency thing so you can see what level he's on. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe it helps you get on his level. Leany? I hear you running around. Where'd you go? There you are, Leany, Leany Boog. <laughs> I love how I've slowly gone from like being terrified of this monster to treating him like he's a dog, <laughs> to treating him like he's a pet. Being like, who's my best Boog? Who's my best Boog? Who knows how to boogie down? You do, Leany. <laughs> I would be the most annoying, like, I don't know, person to to kill, <laughs> to capture for a... Uh, a monster like Leany Boog. Hi, Boogie. No, Boogie. That's a bad Boogie. No, get out of the corner. Get down from the corner. You're not allowed in the corners. Don't make me pull out the spray bottle. I'll pull out the spray bottle. Leany. Leany. Come on. You're glitching through the ceiling. Ugh. Is there like, you know how there are dog trainers and even there are like cat trainers and stuff like that? Like there are animal behaviorists. Can I have like one come in and try to like help train my Leany Boog? Because my Leany Boog needs training. They keep trying to kill me and it's kind of annoying. <laughs> Okay, anyways. Ah! I don't know what that sound was. <laughs> I don't know what that sound was. <laughs> I've never made that sound in my life. But I didn't know he could do that. And I kind of wish he gave me a bit more warning. Usually he gives me a bit more warning. <laughs> Okay, well, that happened, and now I know that can happen. <laughs> Good to know. No, 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 stay. Whew, that was close. Okay, we're good. I just want to make two minutes. You know, it's the bare minimum. The bar is on the floor. The bar is six feet under the ground. I just want to make two minutes. Can we make that happen, Leany? Can we make that happen, my boogie bear? My boogie fox? I don't know. Okay. Like, I'm just slowly devolving into madness. <laughs> I try to get past 
this gigantic humanoid fox, which I feel like is pretty normal at this point, at least in video games. Like, it was absolutely a thing with Five Nights at Freddy's. A lot of people are obsessed with uh, the fox from Zootopia. I forgot his name. I said it earlier. So I feel like, you know, it's a normal thing to, you know, be obsessed with a fox. <laughs> I'm losing my mind. I'm ah! When, where did you come from? Were you upstairs? You've never been upstairs before. My goodness. You're just surprising me in so many new ways. Oh, God, and I can't stand it. <laughs> oh, I see you. You decided to come upstairs for once. There we go. Oh, good. Now I have to worry about upstairs, too. I don't hear anything. Leany, come on. I feel like you're slowly getting more and more aggressive with me. Before you'd stay downstairs for at least two minutes. Now you're coming upstairs. Like, that that wasn't always the case. That didn't used to be the case. Why is it the case now? Why are you slowly getting more difficult? Shouldn't, if anything, you maybe calm down a bit? Are you coming over here? Where are you going? What are you doing? Leany, buddy, uh, where? I heard it. Where? That sounded like it was downstairs. Was it downstairs? I think it was downstairs. If it's downstairs, I'm dead. I'm so dead. <gasps> hey, I made it past two minutes, so it's fine. You can come kill me. Just please let me find you first so you don't scare the crap out of me. Leany, hi, buddy. You can murder me. Thank you. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, I guess now that we made it past two minutes, I'm going to leave this episode of Leany Boo Gear because that was my goal and I made it with 26 seconds to spare. Uh, but yeah, so far it seems like it's going to be a really fun game. Uh, it's very basic, but at the same time they're still developing upon it. And I'm also curious to see, just real quick, I kind of want to see what Play Without the Monster means. Like is it an opportunity just to get used to like, you know, listening for the vents and stuff like that? So you can get used to the mechanics? Or is it just a... Uh an opportunity to check out the map, to check out the house. I think it's just an opportunity to check out the house because there's no timer or anything. Okay. Like I was assuming maybe there would be a timer and you had to close the vents before the timer got to a certain point. Like after 10 seconds, the game would be over and it gives you a chance to like get used to the mechanics without the jump scares. But I guess it's just an opportunity to get used to the house, which is nice too. You can kind of see where everything is uh, and get a sense of your surroundings before the leany boo comes and rips your face off. There we go. <laughs> okay. But yeah, uh, in terms of the game, I give it four leanies out of five books. However, you want to measure that, <laughs> however that works. Um, but yeah, it seems like a really promising concept and it seems like it'll be a lot of fun. I'm just curious to see what they're going to do in terms of development and what they're going to add to the mechanics and maybe the story. Uh, so yeah, I'll be sure to return to this in the future so we can see how development goes. And if you guys would like to play the game for yourself in its current state, I will leave a link in the description to the demo. But that is going to be it for Leany Boog. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video and of course I do want to thank you all for watching and I will see you in our next little adventure. Bye!